going on everybody? Jordan Spencer here and today I'm headed to South Carolina to introduce a couple buddies to Diamondback Firearms. I'm meeting up with Britt and Lindsay who is ex-Special Forces with the U.S. Army, Tyler Conforti who is an up-and-coming country music musician, Patrick Brinson who's never shot a firearm before but he has a sweet mustache so we invited him out, and the one and only Matthew Dolan who is also ex-US Army as a medevac pilot. Now Matthew also owns Connect Tactical where he does self-defense training. So if you're looking to take any self-defense classes, make sure you look him up. But I'm real excited about getting these Diamondback firearms in their hands. And today we're gonna focus on the Diamondback 9mm AM2 pistol. Not bad. That's great, man. That distance, what is that? 30 yards? It's like 130 yards. <laughs> First magazine, 130 yards on steel. No, man, that thing is really smooth. I like, I like it a lot. Shoot it. This thing feels really good. That's a that's crazy, man. Yeah. You For how just, small you can this thing tell is. Looking back behind the gun, how much you can manage that recoil. Yeah. That gun stays right on target, no matter how fast you shoot. We're still hot. Let's do a couple more. Yeah, you can, uh... Man, I like this thing. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, you're so high in the grip. Mm -hmm. And even for, you know, polymer frame guns, metal slide, it's just, it's not even, I mean, it's just compact. It that's is. That's the thing about it. You feel like you're shooting a full length Exactly. It's compact, but you can get your entire hand on the gun. You can control the entire gun. I mean, they did good even with the, the short magazine. Yeah. I get my or the standard magazine. Hand. With, I don't have a small hand. Yeah, I don't either. But I, I mean, I can still get the whole grip on the gun. Even if I want to, for concealed carry purposes. I think that starts a lot with being able to grip it as high as you can. Yeah. You know, you make up ground here rather than being so low and your hand being off the, off the handle. Absolutely. I agree, if this was any different, you'd be hanging off like most subcompact or compact pistols. That's what you end up with. You end up with this funny thing and then you gotta carry the one magazine even though they gave you three with it. But this one, you can run all of them. It's flawless, man. I like it. And the wall is really good. Yeah. It's crisp, but I mean, you find it fast. Exactly. That's you it. You acquire it fast and yeah. once you hit it, you know exactly where it's gonna break. Right there. Yeah, good reset. That's cool, dude. I like that a lot. It's it's nice when you can buy something and you don't got to put a bunch of pieces, parts in it. Exactly. Spend another three hundred dollars. Put on that. That yeah. ready to go right out of the box. Yeah, the weight's right. And look at that. Ready it's to run. It's a Glock magazine or a Glock, Glock holster. Yeah. That's it's awesome. A win win. I'll take it. <laughs> no man, I wanna uh, I wanna try this thing out at fifty meters. Shoot. I bet the gun can hit it. I don't know if I can, but we're on, on it at uh, 25. We're on the metric system now. That's right. You see where that's hitting? Yeah, so that your first shot was high right. So is it the one o'clock just over the shoulder? 11 o'clock. Yeah, cut the target in half. Nice. That's all it is. Nice shot. It's 
pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah, man, I, I absolutely love this thing out of the box. It's just, it fits great, feels great, shoots great. I didn't think we'd be plinking steel at 25 meters with this thing. Um, let alone 50. Yeah, let alone 50. You know, it's just, uh, it feels great. I guess if I had one, one drawback, I think I'd like to see a little bit more, um, you know, a little bit more profile on the slide release. So a little bit, but then, you know, that's, that's one of those things that these guns have 50 rounds through it. You know, it could 200 rounds, 300 rounds, this thing will, it'll, it'll, uh, you know, it'll wear in and I think that'll be a lot easier to, to release. What do you think, Pat? Never shot a gun before. For, for a new shooter, I mean, it was, it was comfortable. Um, be a good, good first gun too for myself to learn on and I even hit a, hit a couple targets. That wasn't yeah. bad. <laughs> no big deal. No big deal. Yeah. Nope. I was, I was yeah. super impressed with it. I'm, you know, as a civilian that likes to carry every day, this is definitely something I'd love to add to my collection. Um, you know, it feels like I'm shooting an eight to nine hundred dollar gun to me, honestly. I, I was very impressed. Yeah. So. Absolutely, it's really tight. Um, that's another thing that tolerances are, they're really tight. Um, I know they got to start loosening up um, at certain points because they're worried about causing malfunctions. And, different manufacturing ammunition and everything else that goes in with that. The only thing um, I would I would like to see is maybe just a little more aggressive uh, grip up here um, just for your, your support hand. Uh, my thumb also obviously, you know, sweating and everything, but uh, just a little more grip, grip, grip space for that would be phenomenal. So a little grip, that's it though. I mean, that could be done at home. For the price point on this, it's it's insane. Not it's to mention brand. metal metal sights. I mean, yeah. like usually something something in a, a pistol. As soon as you start going down in price, they sacrifice something yeah, somewhere. Yeah, I mean sights, trigger. Yeah, that's the first thing to go when people start cutting cutting expense on a that's gun. That's exactly and, it. And and they didn't cut it here. Nope. And it shows. I mean, it does. It, it absolutely shows. I'm I'm impressed. It makes you when like, you just you nailed the nail on the head when you're like, man, I feel like I'm shooting a nineteen hundred dollar gun. Yeah. You know, and, and I've shot those as well, and I'm like, well, that's what you got to spend to get that that out of a gun, and you don't you don't have to do that necessarily. So, it's awesome. Cool. Yeah. Keep what, coming. What else do you like? Me? I'm, I'm gonna buy one. At yeah. least one. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you got you got an indicator, you got round indicator right there. I mean, you got the obviously the cock indicator in the back. Some guys like that. I feel like they did just put everything in it. You know. They took a. Uh, it's American made. Yeah. You know what I mean? Oh yeah. What's Not a, to mention what that. What is 100% American made these days? <laughs> yeah. That's yeah. worth a lot. That's worth a lot. That's worth a ton right there.